everyone welcome back to my channel um if you're not already make sure that you subscribe to my channel and if you are new welcome to my channel my name is louisa and this is it's lady lise um let's just get straight into the video guys excuse the blinds um but today's video i am going to be recording um well i'm going to be doing a review on this product it is the brother brother pt d400 a d p touch label maker um i actually saw this in someone else's video i'm not 100 percent sure whose but it was already after I was ordering it and she had a lot good to say about it. So I'm actually extremely excited. Um, I obviously, this is a different day. Well, not obviously. So today is Thursday. Um, I originally, the last little clips, like my introduction and me reading the instructions was actually on Monday. But it is now Thursday. Um, like I said, I am taking a little break from YouTube. But I'm still recording this so that way I can eventually just um, upload it and you guys will be able to see these videos. Um, so honestly, I was taking a break because I was trying, like I'm still am, I still am trying to get myself together. And this lighting is so bomb, y'all. Um, but I was honestly trying to get myself together. Um, I have so many assignments I have to do. And that's actually what I was in the middle of doing um and i just have not been feeling the greatest i've just been super exhausted super drained and just just terrible um so i have been taking a little break from youtube um especially since i have low storage on my phone and that is where i record everything for you guys but just before we do get started um i have I was reading the instructions for you guys. You guys will see that after. But it was Monday. Um, and I actually recorded this video already. But I just deleted the other footage. Because it was just so terrible. And honestly, the tape got stuck in the label maker. And the tape got stuck in the label maker. And it just was like I ruined the whole sample tape. So I actually ordered the clear I have it over here. I actually ordered this clear um, tape. It is black print on clear tape. It's the PT Brother tape, obviously, because that is the brand of the maker, the label maker. So, sorry, the ring light's in it. So, um, this is what I have already in here. And I honestly made sure it worked before I even started recording this video because it just was not working and honestly i feel like i put it uh, yeah and i'm missing a nail but <laughs> honestly i feel like um i just feel like i put it in wrong so yeah we're just gonna get straight into this review because i don't want this to be super long so we're just gonna go ahead and read the instructions real quick and then we'll be right back So now that you guys saw me reading the instructions, um, like I said, that was Monday. I already know pretty much how to work it. Um, I've been educating myself um, on it since that like fail and I just straight up deleted the footage. It just looks so terrible and I was just having so many technical difficulties. So anyways, let, getting into the review, um, now that we read the instructions together, um we're just gonna get straight into it so i am just going to show you guys um i don't know how i'm gonna show you guys so i want to just like i'm just gonna sit right here so this is what the machine looks like and right up here is the tape that i have inside like i said the black on clear so you just turn it on now you can either put all the batteries in the back which i didn't know that it was 
a choice. I thought you had to do it. So in the other video, I also, I have this adapter for it that they give you. So you don't need the batteries, but if you don't use the batteries, you need to have this plugged in. And if you want it to be like portable and really on the go, then you can go ahead and put the batteries in. But I did not know that you could choose either or. So I'm honestly probably going to take those batteries out because those were the last of my double A batteries and we put them in together in the last video. But like I said, I just deleted everything. So we're just going to go ahead and um, like I said, I have the batteries in so I don't need that plugged in. So the batteries are in there. And then the way that you would open it is you would just, there's this little piece right here. You'll just pull, you can use this side too. So you'll just pull it open just like that. And there's the tape. I'm not going to take it out because I honestly feel like that was the issue last time is I put it in there and then it messed up. And then I like pulled it out and I feel like I messed it up more. So the first, just keep in mind, I mean, you guys may know a little more about it, but if you get this machine, just keep in mind that the tape is super fragile. And if you put it in there wrong, it could mess up like the whole tape and you don't want to do that. Um, I'm so happy that it was only the sample. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. I actually did, where did my phone go? Oh, I record on my phone. So I actually um, made a little label and I just put it on the back of my phone because it was super cute. It just did my name. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to turn it on. And you, as you can see right here, it has this. So you can just, it's literally just like a computer. So you're going to go ahead and type whatever. I'm just going to go ahead and click print. And for the copies, I just want one. So I'm going to go ahead and only do the one. And as you guys see, it is coming out. And it wastes so much tape. Honestly, I'm not mad at it. But then again, I am. Because this tape, I could be using so much more to fill that little bit. So it's honestly not bad. And we're just going to go ahead and click the little scissors button down. And as you see, it, it just fell. So... This is what it looks like is it says boxer slash socks and it's that uh, bubble font that we chose. So this is actually super cute guys. Um, And whenever you just like I said, whenever you see the back, there is this like little line like you see the little pieces. So there are two little pieces and you could just go ahead and pull it. And then it's black on clear. So I'm just going to go ahead and shut that back up because I will be using this for my son. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and make the rest for his stuff. So this is what the bubble font looks like. And then this is what that one fancy font. I believe it's like, I don't remember which one it was called. But that one is so cute, guys. Um, so I'm probably going to be using, I'm not sure what I'm going to be using for my business. But as you guys can see, these are the label maker. I mean, this is the labels that it brings out. And it's honestly so convenient. Um, And honestly, I have this like plastic drawer back there. I'm going to go ahead and make labels for that. So for the rest of the video, um, I'm just going to make a couple more labels that I need. And then once I finish doing that, um, I'm just going to give you guys a quick like review on it. Since that is what the video is today. Um so yeah we're just gonna go ahead and print out a couple more um and i'm honestly gonna like flip i'm gonna try to flip the the camera okay guys i'm back and this is as best as i can do you guys are literally sitting on the top of my mini fridge um so this is the best i can do i'm gonna go ahead and move the light down just so you guys can see a little better okay this way you guys see the whole machine so now like i said i'm just gonna go ahead and do everything that i was gonna do for that so you see this i'm gonna go ahead and click clear and then i'm gonna click okay it gives you two options um you can either clear the text and format or the text only i'm gonna go ahead and click 
text and format so we have that clean slate so i'm gonna go ahead and do bras and again you guys need to hold in the shift button like any computer or anything and click this and then bras and under there So now I'm going to go into font and I'm going to go ahead and choose what font I want. I'm going to go ahead and do this font. And I like everything else. So we're going to go ahead and click print. It asks you if you want how many copies do you want. I'm okay with one. So I'm just going to go ahead and click okay. And now it comes out of the side. Oop, oop. So it comes out of the side right here. And ooh, you guys can, okay, so right here you see me holding this button. It's just going to cut that label. And this is the label we just made. So this is what I have for my thing. Obviously, my son doesn't wear bras and underwear. He's still in pull-ups. So we're going to go ahead and clear that. Text and format. Oh, we shouldn't have done that. Okay, so now... For the second drawer, which is boxers. Because me and my boyfriend share our thingy. So now for the font, I'm going to go ahead and try to find that font. 07 Cal is the one that we chose. So I'm going to go ahead and click print. One copy is okay. And it is just printing that out. And voila, we have boxers. Oh, 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 excuse the little, little mess. <laughs> so this is the label that we have. It says boxers. Like I said, um, I don't really like how small it's coming out. So we're going to go ahead and redo this one. We're just going to go into font. And for the size, we're going to do 42 points. And we're going to click OK and just reprint that. See, the text is too high. So we're going to go back into font and try to go down to 36 points. Click OK. Text is too high. So 24. And 24 is good. I believe that's probably what this is. We're going to go ahead and check anyways. So it was actually a little bit bigger. Actually, no, it was not. It's the exact same size. So we're going to go into font and we're just going to do auto since that's too big. And we're just going to click OK, click clear text only because we're doing these labels for the same um, dresser. So I want all of my fonts on like each thing to be the same so they're not all over the place. So I'm going to go ahead and do the last one. Um, well, I'm going to make two. So I'm going to do... my socks because we share a drawer for our socks and it's like half my socks and half his socks because it's just super convenient um so i'm gonna go ahead and do my socks just click okay because we're okay with everything and then click print okay again and then i just made that label so that is the label for my socks so, so far, we only have three drawers, but I'm going to make two for the last drawer. So, we have bras and underwear, boxers, my socks, and then we're going to go ahead and click clear, text only. And then I'm going to go ahead and put babe's socks because, as I said, me and my boyfriend, not six, shift me and my boyfriend share a sock drawer, which you guys are probably like, this broke B. Like, no, it's actually not bad. <laughs> um, So I'm going to go ahead and click print because everything is okay. And then copies, okay. And it is printing out. You guys cannot see the printing process. Um, and I go ahead and cut it and then babe's socks. So these are the labels that I made just now for our drawers. Um, 
these are the labels so we have bra underwear bras and underwear boxers my socks and my boyfriend's socks so these are the labels for our one drawer um and like i said this is super convenient i'm so excited about this and the tape honestly is so cheap this one at least the clear tape so we're gonna just go ahead and finish off doing we're gonna do text and format and we're just gonna finish off doing my son's so this is the one for his um so far we just did boxers and socks so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make um his sock oh wait no his shorts drawer because he has his shorts right under his boxers and socks so i went ahead and i typed in shorts and i'm gonna go ahead and click font and i'm gonna go back to this bubble font and there it is and we're just gonna click okay and print and then okay again and it is printing now i'm not sure if you can kind of see it it prints from right here um and then this is the shorts label so as you can see it's the same font um and this will be his font and i'm just gonna go ahead and finish making the last two and then i have three more that i can make with you guys and i'm just gonna give you guys a brief review um so so far i give this machine a 10 out of 10 we're gonna go ahead and do text only because this is for the same thing um we're gonna go ahead and do jeans oh no we're gonna go ahead and do PJ pants. And now I lied. So this is his sweats. His sweats slash pants. Which is basically the same thing. Um, sweat slash PJs. That's what we'll do. And we're going to go ahead and click print. And then click OK. And that is printing out. And then that is the sweat slash PJs. And then we're going to go ahead and do clear again text only and then we're gonna do jeans slash pants because those were sweat slash pjs and these are the jeans slash pants gonna go ahead and click print click okay print this last one out and then we're gonna make three more guys um i know you guys don't just want to watch me make these um so this is the last one for my son's room. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and make the three for my... I have a plastic drawer filled with products for my um, website. And I just have lashes um, in one drawer. And then I have the shades in the other drawer. And... Um, socks in the last one so i don't know if you guys saw but i just chose i just typed out lashes and i chose this font um just because i really like this font i chose this font for the sticker for my business drawer so now this boxer is one we could honestly just throw away since i made two of the same one um but i'll probably end up keeping it and then we're gonna go ahead and click clear text only because we use the same one for all the rest and we're gonna just type in shades like i said i have shades we're gonna click print and okay and then we have the shades label right there excuse my nails y'all so we have lashes shades and last but not least we have socks knee-high socks oop I forgot the H
Mm, we're gonna go ahead and plug print. Okay. And there is the knee high socks. So today we just made um i'm gonna go ahead and flip the camera again so i can show you guys everything that we made and give you guys the review so i can wrap up the video and yeah so as you guys saw i just finished printing out the last label which was um for my business so i'm gonna go ahead and click clear we're gonna go up to text and format and click okay because we want to clear everything i'm just going to go ahead and turn it off i'm honestly probably just going to take off the batteries and plug it into the wall just because this label maker um will more than likely just sit on my desk and i honestly have a new desk coming in so i will be guys i will be giving you guys a desk tour coming soon so i'm excited for that and i know i'm promising you guys all these videos but they're gonna come um, they may not come now. Do I have sweat stains? No, I don't. What is that? That looks like... It looks like I got something on there, doesn't it? I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping. <laughs> but, um, this label maker, honestly, guys, at first, I was gonna give it a 0 out of 10. Well, honestly, I was gonna give it, it like, a 7 or 6 out of 10, just because it was getting jammed. Um, so... I'm not sure if this happens with everyone with the sample packet um, tape, but it happened with me and I ended up wasting the whole sample packet of the tape, which was black on white. So I didn't really care too much, but I was just like, I don't want to order these clear tapes and them not work because this was pretty pricey. Um, So this, I got this from Amazon. Um... And I honestly just got it because I was looking at label makers and I'm like, how much is a label maker, honestly? Because I have so many different labels that I have to use. So I need labels for, like, I have so many different labels that I have in general because when I started this business, I was just, like, curious and I was, like, exploring all the labels. So like I said in my last video, um, well, one of my last videos, a lot of the labels are going to be a little messy and stuff because I have so many for everything. So now, since I have this, I will be able to make labels right then and there. Um, I'm probably just going to end up making all of my labels tonight now that I know how to do this. Um, and I still have a lot I have to do. So I have, I have to get labels for my packages. And honestly, I got these for the knee-high socks because they need to go in a bag and not just being shipped out without a bag because um they just need a bag so they're not dirty and they're honestly in a drawer right now so it's keeping them safe they're not getting dirty or anything that drawer has not been opened in so long so i'm gonna be using the label maker for a lot of things um like i just showed you guys I'm going to be using the label maker on like dressers and stuff oh, on dressers and stuff like that and um just like stuff around the house and a lot for my business so I mainly got this for my business but now that I have it it's just like why not use it for stuff um and it, I just feel like it's going to be super easy so I'm going to just show you guys the labels that we made here together, even though you guys already saw. I'm just going to show you guys them again and basically just give you finish giving you the review. So what I feel, um, how I feel about it now, I definitely give this product a 10 out of 10 because it's just so amazing. And for the price that it was, like I was saying, it's a little pricey. I believe it was around like 50 60 bucks but that's honestly not bad um and the tape is like 9.99 on amazon so hopefully the tape lasts a long time but other than that um whenever you order labels and stuff it's gonna be more and more and more and you're gonna end up spending more than when you have this product so 
I'm super excited about the fact that I have this now and I'm excited that it one of the things that I really liked about it the most is now that I just found out you don't need the batteries so like six batteries is a lot of batteries um and that was my whole brand new pack I had a brand new pack of batteries and that was the whole thing um but I feel like it's super convenient to have this just because if you are using this for work or at your office or whatever, you can just leave it on your desk and just plug it into an outlet and it'll work no matter what. So I actually do have an outlet right behind me, but I'm not going to be plugging this in because it does the same thing. Um, and I just feel like this product is so amazing and I would definitely recommend getting it if you're like just making a business or you want to be a small business owner or do you, if you already have your own little small business or just if you have kids in general or just if you like being organized um I'm a super organized person so I like having things like labeled and I like knowing what things are so this is super perfect for me and I'm really excited about it um so I definitely rate this a 10 out of 10 and I'm super excited about it. This is just so perfect and I feel like everyone should get one, <laughs> honestly. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and go over the labels real, well, real quick with you guys. So I know you guys probably really don't care about my, my personal things, but this is for my plastic dresser I have. So this says bras slash underwear and then the second drawer is my boyfriend's boxers. So it just says boxers because obviously... I wear bras and underwear and he wears boxers um and then the third drawer will just be like this well like this because it says babe socks in my socks so that just separates our socks in the third drawer um and I feel like that's super convenient um these are honestly so amazing and then for my sons I just have his boxers and socks, his shorts, his sweats and PJs, and his jeans and pants. So it's super convenient, like I said. You can use it for anything. I'm using it for everything. <laughs> um, and it's honestly great. And I'm actually excited. That's why I wanted to redo this whole video. But I didn't want to make it too long, and I know that it's long already just by how many times I already left and came back. So this is the last one that I have for you guys. Um, This is the lashes. So I have a plastic dresser with my products in it. And then the top drawer is the lashes. The second drawer is the shades. And the third drawer is the knee high socks. So I think this font is super cute. Um, And I'm honestly... That's another reason I give it a 10 out of 10 because it has so many different fonts and just so many different options. Like, um, they just have so many different things on here and it's just so amazing. Like I said, for the price that it is, I honestly think it's worth it, especially if you're an organized person. Um, it can be used for everyday use, for office use, um, for school stuff. Like, if you don't want to write, if you don't have nice handwriting, you can use it to mark your um, your kids' notebooks. Um, I know you can use notebooks for school for any grade. You can use notebooks from like kindergarten up until college. I, I'm in college and I use notebooks, but I just wrote on them, which I honestly wish I would have just used the labels, but I feel like that's a little too much. So like i said guys i rate this item a 10 out of 10 and this is what it looks like it's super light guys um and i just feel like it's so like it's super amazing and it's just like extremely convenient so i really love this product um you can get any different kind of tape like you can get blue white on blue red on white black on and like you can get different tapes and stuff for it and you can do like different things like I was saying this is like kind of the different options like you can do different ones um and I just really think that's super cute guys so it's pretty much like it's pretty much super easy and if you just look at the um instructions you guys will get it 
Um, but like I said, this product is super amazing. I'm getting over a sickness. I have been feeling so terrible. Um, I don't know why. It just came out of nowhere, but we're not here for that. We're here for this review. So like I said, guys, I give the product a 10 out of 10. It is absolutely amazing. I'm going to go ahead and put these labels on everything because why not? Um, so like I said, it's amazing. 10 out of 10 and I cannot wait to use it more for my products and I honestly cannot wait. And I also did not mention, um, I don't know my voice cracked. So there was a little bit of a family issue with my launch date that I chose. So I'm actually, instead of launching this Friday, which is literally tomorrow, I am going to be launching on the, which is actually a good thing because I will have time to like better prepare so that's all i have for you guys today um i hope you enjoyed this video and if you really did enjoy this video make sure that you guys give this a big thumbs up make sure that you comment share and subscribe we are at i believe 57 subscribers guys so let's try to make it to at least 60 i know we can do it um and like i said you guys will not be seeing this video right away because it took a literally like almost a full week to even record this video but, like I said, I am taking a little break from YouTube. So, like I said, this is the end of the video, guys. And I hope that you have an amazing night since it's night again. I always record at night. Um, I feel like that's when I have the most energy is at night, which is so bad. But, like I said, that's the end of the video, guys. So, have an amazing day. Like, comment, share, subscribe. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. Yeah. You already know. We run!